Welcome to the AGU. This is the American Gym Physical Union, and we're here to meet our authors, reviewers, and editors for our journals. This is the premier conference for earth sciences, and there are over 16,000 delegates here. Today we'll be meeting some students um, who Elsevier has sponsored for a student travel grant. Paul, welcome to the AGU. Thank you very much for coming. Um, could you start by telling us a little about yourself? Sure. My name is Paul Byrne. Uh, I'm 26 years old. I'm from the Department of Geology in Trinity College, Dublin. Uh, I did my undergrad degree there in geology, finishing in 2005. And then I did a PhD in the department looking at the deformation of volcanoes on Mars. Fantastic. Um, and Elsevier is sponsoring this uh, student travel grant to the AGU. Um, can you tell us why conference attendance is important to you? Uh, it's important for, I guess, two reasons, two primary reasons that I can see. One is that the key yeah. members of, of the field yeah. you're in, whatever yeah. discipline yeah. it is, will be presenting their data at the conference, especially large international conferences like AGU. And so it's a really great place, especially for students, to go and basically act, it acts as a sounding board for research and progress before they submit, and then maybe closer to, say, the, the submission of a paper or the thesis itself, to really get feedback from the community in that regard. And the second really right. great opportunity it provides is contact with those people on a personal level. Right. Because yeah. it means when, when it comes really to, like, where the like position I'm at now, deciding where yeah. to apply for postdoc positions, it really helps to have an idea of who's doing what and where. And by meeting them at a conference and establishing right. a kind of a personal relationship with them, it helps them when they're applying for those positions right. later. Fantastic. Um, and what aspect of the conference has had the most impact on your kind of continued learning? I think the most... The biggest impact I've had is seeing the, the breadth no, uh, of research in my discipline. I, I, so I guess specifically I look at Martian volcanism, so that includes new advances in volcanism on Earth and new advances in understanding of how Mars as a planet works. And one can read papers and see the breadth of stuff available online, but when you go and you see that data being presented by a person in a, at a poster or in a room, it really gives you a sense of what it is they're doing and the breadth of stuff that's out there, which in turn can open up a whole new set of opportunities for your own research. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Um, and finally, what does um, Elsevier mean to you? Well, Elsevier, to me, uh, provides two really useful, I guess, the interlinked advantages. One is that Elsevier publishes a range of geoscience and earth science journals with a whole gamut of information that ranges from, in my case, volcanoes to Mars. And so, as a, as a resource, as a learning resource, especially through, say, a, a library subscription in Trinity, I can access a whole range of journals published by Elsevier that give me information that's really useful for my PhD. And the flip side of that is that it then presents a whole range of journals to which I could apply to submit my, my uh, work for publication and therefore kind of increasing you know uh, people's awareness of my work and making contacts in the field that way. Fantastic. Thank you very thank much you. for joining us. Thank you very thank much. You. Bye bye. Zero. Majinda, thank you very much for coming. Um, could you start by telling us a little bit about yourself, your name, where you come from, the university, and what you're studying? Please. My name is Rajinda uh, Jagpal. I came from uh, York University, Toronto, Canada. And I'm doing uh, my PhD over there under the supervision of uh, Professor Ben Coyne. And I'm working on project. Uh, I built a space instrument, and I'm studying greenhouse gases. Fantastic! Thank you very much. Um, and can you tell me why the conference is important to you? Yeah, th this kind of conference is very good uh, for a student like me because uh, we meet different people from all over the world, and we get networking. And this will help, like uh, in the future project. Like uh, I think uh, the issues are like now the whole world is a one global village. So if we have a good networking and we can make a, our project, we can have a dealing with other people. Then we, our project will be bigger and better. Fantastic. Um, and what aspect of the conference has had the most impact on your continued learning? Yeah, here I meet some renowned scientists and uh, some people from all over the world. So this will, uh, like, I learn what they are doing in their research, and uh, this will also give me some feedback. And uh, so attending different uh, lectures, so this will improve my knowledge, and then I get most of the knowledge, and I will use it in my future research. Great, thank you very much. Um, and Elsevier is, is obviously sponsoring your travel grant, and we're, we're pleased to do that. Mm -hmm. um, can you tell us uh, what what Elsevier means to you? Elsevier is uh, like one of the renowned uh, publishers because uh, whenever I have to find any research paper, the first choice is always of mine is Elsevier because our university has a uh, because it's very easy for us because university has a library has a dealing with Elsevier 
and moreover I have uh, three publications in Elsevier in the journal called GQSR. That's brilliant. And what do you expect from Elsevier in the future? What would you like to see? Uh, my future goal is to like publish more papers in Elsevier and the same way like Elsevier doing is great job and uh, so I will like get like as I mentioned earlier that all whenever I have to find any research paper I always go to Elsevier. That's great. Thank you very much for your time. Sure. Thank you for You're joining welcome. us. Welcome um, Uchiyo. Uh, thank you very much for um, agreeing to speak to us. Could I ask you to start telling us a little bit more about yourself um, your name, your university, and, and what you're studying, please. Um, I am Michio Sawai from Hiroshima University uh, in Japan. Yes. Um, and, and thank you very much for giving me a uh, travel ground. Uh, I used it for, uh, to buy an air ticket, so it's very helpful. Thank you. And I worked on, uh, I, I began to work on Nojima Port. Um, and this food um, called by uh, called earthquake right. in 1995. Mm -hmm. um, so I collected samples from Nojima port zone and conducted um, high velocity picture experiments yes. um, to reproduce um, to reproduce seismic force motion. Okay. Um, I hope the Called earthquake we can be produced can be reproduced by modeling mm -hmm. using uh, for, uh, for using uh, measures uh, for the properties. Okay, great. Um, and how has the conference helped you with your research? Um, I, I the reason I wanted to attend. AGU is the biggest meeting in the world. Yeah. Um, I wanted to know what kind of uh, researches are going on now. Great. Yeah. That's thank you. Um, and what aspect of the conference um, has been most important to you? Because there's been a subject that you've learned about while you've been here. Um, I gave an um, oral presentation at this meeting yeah. and so I practiced English very hard. Yes. Yeah. So but um, after the presentation I realized uh, I have to practice English more very hard. So um, uh, in the future yeah. I want it I want to attend a graduate school yes. abroad. Yes. So my supervisor yeah. uh, good to go, uh, has, has a good friend yeah. uh, at the Utrecht University. Yes. Uh, so I I apply for the doctor course yeah. uh, at the Utrecht University after my master's course. Yeah. So this is a big chance and to see uh, abroad and other researchers. Okay, excellent. Thank you. Um, and how do you see um, your work with Elsevier progressing in the future? What does Elsevier mean to you? Um, it's here, um, I think this uh, you're publishing very good journals, and I gave a presentation this meeting. Yeah. Uh, I. I'd like to submit a paper yes. and the Journal of Structural Geology. Yeah. So, and my, uh, the research area I work in is technophysics. Yeah. And I heard um, from my supervisor um, that the world technophysics is established by the your uh, journal of technophysics. So yeah. I want to Right, you want to submit them. Okay, brilliant. Thank you very much. Thank yeah. you very much.